Hi and welcome, my name is John Ifragan, I'm from All Total Coaching. Why, what I want to talk to you today is why you're confused, why you lost, why you're wavering in the wind, and why you are so indecisive. Today, I'm going to go into it and I'll explain to you the basics, why this happens to you, and what to do in order to solve this issue. But before we start, I'd like to talk about a program, How to Be a Man, what your father never taught you. This will change your life. Money back guarantee. In our book, we talk about man. What is a man? How to be a man? Woman, relationships and sex. Media, manipulation, indoctrination via the movies. Health, food and exercise and why it's so important. Money, wealth, what you need to know, what you've never been taught at school. Value, what is value? And why it's so important. How to overcome the biggest phenomenon in generation. The mainstream uh, media, tuck under the table. Depression and fear. I explain it, I, I, I go into details, and more than anything, we talk about the suicide. So you can never be a statistic. Nobody thinks that this will happen to him, but we all know somebody that either committed suicide or is depressed in a very bad state of mind. Feminism, the real truth, and happiness and fulfillment. So today, we're going to talk about why you're confused and you don't get things done. The most important thing, you don't have a purpose. You don't have goals. The moment you don't have a purpose and you don't have a goal, you're going to waver. You're on Facebook. You're on Twitter. You're on the phone 24 hours a day. You can't sleep without your phone. You're in front of your computer at work and you're look, look, looking what he said on Facebook, on Twitter, or on Instagram, or this one or that one. In order to achieve anything, to get places, you need to disconnect. For our 2018, I disconnected and I wrote my book. I'm not trying to drum my ticket here, but if you do not disconnect, you'll go waver from place to place, from Instagram to Facebook to Snapchat to here to there. And then all you're going to do is gossip and talk and talk and talk. Those that talk the most are the ones that do the least. And those the ones that do the least are the ones who talk the most. In the book of, of Napoleon Hill, he says, don't tell them, show them. We live in a talk of society and wannabe society, but nobody does, majority of people don't do anything because they don't have a purpose. They don't have goals. They don't have a vision for themselves. So the web of from one party to the next, to the next and they end up watching porno. I don't have to tell you the drill, but you already know. So how do you disconnect? Start disconnecting one hour to half an hour. Put the phone away, like I put it away. Go for a run without the, the phone. Go to the gym without the phone. Do things without your phone. If you're continuously posting pictures that you're at the gym, we both know you're not exercising because those that really exercise or those that really train are the ones that don't have to continuously post. And I'll tell you one thing bluntly, those that post the most pictures on Facebook, or Instagram, whatever, they're the ones who do the least and are the most depressed. Don't take my word for it. Google depression connection to posting on Facebook and Instagram and you'll find that what I just said to you now is the truth. The more people post, the more they want to show up that life is amazing when really it's, it's in dire straits and they're absolutely miserable. You know it and I know it. I'm not saying you shouldn't post at all, but you shouldn't continuously post. So focus, disconnect, focus on your goal. You don't have a purpose, find one. Go on the net, put purpose, and you see hundreds and hundreds of videos. How to get a purpose and have goals. The other reason you are confused because you're lazy. You're lazy. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. I'll stop smoking tomorrow, next week, Monday. If only I had money, if I only had the looks. If, 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 if. Life is not about if. If life is about taking action now. When I decided to lose weight, I didn't say tomorrow. I started running that day that I realized I have to lose weight. Today I ran in the heat of 40 degrees. I'm not drumming my ticket here. It's the point is, if you want to do something, you do it regardless of all the obstacles. And you're gonna always have obstacles. Whether it's the heat, it's too cold, it's too early, it's too late, there's always gonna be an excuse or your favorite program. Start cutting, find a purpose, find a goal, and 
And I promise you one thing. Once you find a focus and your goal, and if, you, if the goal is too big, divide it into small, small little steps, and you will achieve great things. Any person that achieved greatness in this life are the ones that focused. Anyone that achieved anything are the ones that disconnected. But if you're not willing to disconnect, and you want to become rich, and you want to become fit, yet you don't want to put the work into it, we all know that sooner or later you're going to become a bad flat snow, uh, fat snow. I'm not systematically attacking anybody here. I'm just telling you the real truth. It's your life. It's your choice. You want to change? Fine. You don't want to change. You're going to keep doing the same thing again and again and again. Complain about the same things again and again and again. But nobody gives up what you get the job. Thank you very much for listening. Look us up at www.altorocoaching. I can change your life. The question is, do you want to? Or are you going to keep doing the same thing again and again? Complaining again and again? Expecting different results? And you think a woman's going to land on you and fall in love with you. Nobody gives a shit. Our most important thing in life is value. What you give value to society. The choice is yours. Purchase a book. Learn so you can be who you want to be. Rather than drifting like majority of people. Drifting in, in the wind. And they keep changing their opinion according to the weather, the, the society, the, the fashion or whatever. And they wonder why they're miserable. Thank you very much for listening. Email us at john at sosdating.com. As always, you know I'm, I'm your friend, Johnny Fugan. Bye-bye.